Hey, it's a very special five o'clock somewhere because today is my wife's birthday. She's having a birthday today. So <laughs> gonna let her choose what we do today. Kind of slept in, took it casual. And uh, she picked out a restaurant 30 miles away in Red Bluff that we want to try. So we're jumping on the interstate. Gonna go check this place out. It used to be the green barn, but now it's whiskey something. I thought it was still the green barn. Nope. Bar, no. It's whiskey house or. I have no idea what it's called. Actually, it's still called the green barn, but they added whiskey kitchen to it to give it a little spice. Sounds like a party atmosphere, right? Well, I think they, they do specialize in whiskeys and bourbons. I know Patty said that when they went, they had a flight or something. Wow. Yeah. It's five o'clock somewhere. So, Leanne, in all your years of wisdom, do you have anything you'd like to add to the show today? Better old than dead. Yeah. That's a good one. And uh, in case you didn't know, my wife is a vegetarian. So it doesn't always go good when we go to places. If they're not vegetarian friendly, she has to order appetizer salads and stuff like that. So if you're a restaurant that really wants to attract a whole crowd, vegetarian is the thing right now. Well, it's not just vegetarian, it's vegans. Vegans are a thing and food allergies and stuff. You have been a vegetarian for how long? Lord, let me get my calculator out. Well, well since she was... 41 years ago? Oh, yeah. Since she was 25. 16. <laughs> I'm trying to hide the identity of your age. 57. Wow. Well, proud. A vegetarian for 41 years. Before be being a vegetarian was cool. Sure. Was it cool? Is it cool now? I guess it was cool. But I'm not cool, so what's the matter? Yeah, no. I guess. That's why I eat meat. Because I'm a kick ass cool carnivore. Self-seating for the lunch crowd, so pick anywhere we went. We went in the dining room, and uh, some squawky kids in there, so we thought we'd sit at the bar. We always sit at the bar. And now we just got some guy talking about a steak. Hi, you guys. How are you? good. How are you, Peggy? Okay, we quite possibly have made a mistake at this place by showing up at lunchtime. They have a really nice lunch menu but we asked to see the dinner menu and that thing is spot on so we're gonna have a cocktail a couple appetizers and we're gonna save this place for another vi visit down the road at dinner time found out we went into the back door. I mean, you know what I mean. <laughs> 